Inbar went out on Friday, a day before the bloodiest war unfolded between Israel and Hamas with her friends, to a nature party to promote peace and love. On Saturday morning, she sent a text message to her brother that they'd been under a terror attack. Her brother has since lost contact with her. With the help of her partner's family, they were able to piece together the story of her escape and abduction. We have with us Inbar Herman's uncle, Eli Cohen, who's joining us at the moment. It's a massive hostage crisis that is unraveling as the Israel-Hamas war escalates. Several are said to be kidnapped. How exactly did the entire situation unravel at your end, sir? Uh, Inbar went on uh, Friday uh, last, uh, last week to a party in, the na in uh, some nature celebration party for youngers. And uh, the day after, uh, on Saturday morning, this Saturday morning, uh, suddenly there was a, an attack of uh, more than 1,000, uh, altogether more than 1,000 uh, terrorists from Gaza Strip who just uh, started do, doing a massacre, killing everybody that was there. Um, and they were also chasing uh, uh, to, to catch some other people now. Inba was hiding with two people that she didn't met before, but uh, they were running together and hiding someplace. At some time, they was realizing that uh, two people are chasing them, trying to catch them and uh, maybe kill them or whatever. But and then they ran away uh, for many places, uh, hiding inside bushes. Uh, at some at some point, after several hours. Uh, um, in Ba was not able to continue to run uh, also because she was tired, but also there was uh, some kind of border that, that she, can, she couldn't pass. Uh, she was there with the, the two boys also, but uh, the two terrorists that were chasing after her just uh, put a knife on, on her shoulder, on her uh, throat, and she was surrounding, surrounded and... Uh, the, the, uh, bo the boys that were there, were there was able to uh, escape, but before they escaped, they noticed that in addition to those two terrorists, also another two people on a motorcycle um, took her with, so altogether four people just uh, took her away uh, into the Gaza Strip. And from, from this point, uh, this was the last uh, testimony that somebody saw her Alive, taken by four terrorists into Gaza Strip. Later on, we uh, realized that there is another video showing something similar, uh, but over there uh, we cannot uh, know how how uh, how how much longer it was uh, afterwards. But we do have this testimony. Where is uh, Inba right now, sir? Do you have any information about her? Not exactly. We just know that most probably she is in the Gaza Street somewhere. We don't know anything. We didn't get any formal things uh, about it. We just know that she was kidnapped into Gaza by Hamas terrorists. Mr. Cohen, thank you so much for speaking to India today, sir. So that was Eli Cohen speaking about Inbar Herman.